If you're wondering whether that thing's friendly, it ain't. You don't say. First of all, what thing are we even talking about? Oh shit! They're sending an elephant after us. Welcome back, everybody. Dear Chris, I'm an old guy gaming, and we are going to go ahead and start our next prospect. So, um, I think what we're going to do for this one is we're going to do Death Ray Scam. Um, we should be able to knock it out pretty quickly, and um, we will get another 150 work, credits. And want to take advantage of new territory. If they can get terrain data, they can plan new drop zones, open the place wide up. You got this? So this is your usual scan three places, get attacked by animals uh, type of quest. So we're just going to bang it out really quick. Um, uh, this is going to be one episode. So, I'll, you know, we're, we're only going to do what we have to do uh, to get uh, probably get a, we'll get a longbow and maybe some some flint arrows. But I don't think we need to go any further than that to prepare for this. All right, down we go. Down we go. This this one is going to drop us off in the desert, not the forest biome. Uh, I did this one on, on the multiplayer. But they need help, even out here. They want scans of the region, terrain data, so they can open up new drop zones and get prospectors into the area. Sites are on your map. So grab a radar and... Get going. Grab a radar and get going. Okay. So, um, yep. Basically, guys, I'm going to do the usual. Um, like I said, I'll probably get far enough to make a longbow, um, which means we'll just make a really super small basic shelter, just something to put a crafting bench in. Uh, and then once I'm ready to go, I'll bring you guys back, and we will go hit the three locations. See you in a bit. All right, guys, welcome back. Um, we just had a medium sandstorm come through, so it just finished. It is almost a night time, 1800 hours. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and sleep to reset or, you know, get to morning. Um, and then we will be ready to set out. Let's do it. Okay, uh, so yeah, I just made this little hut here and put down the crafting bench. Uh, we've got longbow. Uh, made up, we got bandages, I have a full tank of oxygen, or nearly full, uh, full water pretty much. Uh, we got a ripe coconut that we'll eat in a little bit, and some meat, and then 47 bone arrows. I don't think I'm going to grind um, for iron or flint arrows. I don't think we need to do that. These should be fine. So, yeah, um, let's go ahead and set off and do this. So, we are going to... Uh, first of all, we have to go pick up the crate, which looks like it's just a little bit uh, to the southeast of us. So let's go get that first. And then we will <clears throat> set off for the first scan location, which I believe is over by the Grand Canyon area that we were in in the last mission where we set up that hunting outpost. I hope those guys are happy with their hunting outpost that I made for them. <laughs> it, was pretty, it was pretty basic. I mean... Can't really get any more basic than that, but they should have been more specific if they wanted something a little more elaborate than that. That's all I got to say. So anyway, <coughs> yeah, we'll knock this mission out quickly um, because, you know, most of this mission, guys, is going to be me running all over the freaking desert to those three spots because they're, they're really far apart. And then, you know, obviously bringing you back when we do the, the scans and the animal attacks and all that sort of thing. Uh, but uh, this is probably going to be a pretty short episode, I'm thinking. All right, is that our crate there? Uh, nope, that's not the crate. I'm missing the berries. Oh, I think they did, they changed something in an update. If you hand harvest these, you now get sticks. And I don't believe that was the case when I was in the desert on the multiplayer game. So there you go. All right, we got a mountain lion over there, and a hyena. Oh, that's a... I thought he was going to keep moving. Well, we don't need our light on anymore. I do have two torches. 
in case uh, it does get dark before we finish all of this, which it might because, again, we've got a lot of running around to do. I wished I had um, some berries on me. I looked around for some squash and didn't really see anything uh, in this area. I wonder if the squash only exists by, like, the oasis, oasis places and not by the rivers. I don't know. It's possible that, that they do, but... You know, just kind of looking around in this area, I don't see any. So, uh, one thing about these plants, though, if you use a, a sickle, um, then you just get fiber. You get a lot of it, but you don't get any sticks. So, you do have to harvest them by hand. But that's a nice change, because it was kind of hard to find fiber. Oh, is that elephant going to get pissed? Oh, he's pissed. <laughs> okay, right away. Right away. See if we can drop aggro here. Oh, there's our, our crate just straight ahead there. Okay. Hopefully the elephant is no longer upset with us. Alright. We'll run this way and grab the crate to get the scanner and then head to the first location. <laughs> Well, excuse me there, bud. Okay, got the scanner. Been there, done this. Uh, let's take a look on the map where we are where we are first going. Okay, yeah, so this is going to be over by the Grand Canyon area. I will see you guys over there. Oh, look at that. We get a, a mature coconut buff and a ripe coconut buff. That's good. Very good to know. So I guess if you had to, you could eat uh, a fresh coconut, a mature coconut, and a ripe coconut and get three separate buffs. That's very useful to know. Man, it's like really, really stuttery in this area. We got ourselves a little a bit of a bleed action going on, too. Those uh, tusks on those guys are nasty. All right, let's fix that. And we're off. All right, our scan location is just right on the other side of the canyon. Uh, so we're going to have to go down that way and come back up. I'm pretty sure that's the same area that we built our little hut in. So I'll see you guys over there. Let's see if we can stair step down here since we have our magic backpack on. Don't want to over jump that. Ouch, that hurt a little bit, but we didn't sprain anything. See if there's any squash along the river here.
All right, there's a the squash. So yeah, I'm of the opinion that squash is only found near lagoons or lakes. Uh, I mean, at least, you know, that's what I've seen so far. Um, so let's get a, a little bit of this and cook it up so we have another stamina food since we have so much running around to do. Oh my goodness. Don't be scaring me like that. Man, I'll tell you what, it is not abundant, that's for sure. Uh-oh. Game just crashed. Damn it. I'll be right back. Okay, we are back. I'm not 100% sure, but... I think I made a, might, might have started the game on DirectX 11 instead of 12. And that might have had something to do with why we had some problems. So I'm not sure if DX11 can handle ray tracing, which my graphics card is using. Uh, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. It, uh, it seems to be better, but then again, we just restarted too. So we'll see how things go. Man, that squash is really scarce it is not all over the place that's for sure um i don't remember if i tried the sickle on a squash plant you, most of the most of that stuff you can't sickle you have to pick hand pick but if we come across another one let's just try it and see what happens no it's still kind of stubbory around here i don't know Okay, let's see if the sickle works on this. Nope, it doesn't. An herbaceous fruit, it says. Okay, well, let's uh, stop here and just set up a quick campfire and cook up the squash that I did get. And I'll knock down a couple more coconut trees as well um, and see if we can get some coconuts. And then we will proceed. Okay, so we got six roast squash there, <clears throat> and I got some young coconuts. I ate one young coconut now um, to get that buff going, and then I knocked a few more trees down, and I wanted to wait a little bit longer before I checked them, so the coconuts, uh, should we get them, will last a little bit longer, especially now that I know you get the buff for each stage. Do we get any more? A little bit more. <coughs> okay. I think we're ready to proceed. Uh, here, let's do this one too. Um, I'm going to put that cooked meat in there and just let it go, but I don't think we're going to need it. Well, you know what, though? Yeah. We can make another campfire later if we need to. All right, let's get this show on the road. So we are going to eat a squash, which is going to give us a melee damage bonus. And uh, we now have some more stamina and stamina regen. Uh, let's hit this one, too. And we got another coconut. Nice. Okay. And we are at the first scan location. This is the zone. It's around here somewhere. Good. Okay. We're reading the station. It's active. If you're wondering whether that thing's friendly, it ain't. You don't say. First of all, what thing are we even talking about? Oh, shit. They're sending an elephant after us.
Looks like the unit stopped. Get it back online or you're gonna be here for a while. Dang. Okay. Let's get all of our arrows back here. Uh, do we have a chance of getting prime meat off of this guy? I'll bet you we do. We just didn't get him out, get it off of him. Uh, okay. Near extinct on Earth, enduring on Icarus. All right, let's turn the thing back on. Wow, I was expecting like <laughs> hyenas or something, not a friggin' elephant. That's Goodness. It. Systems online. Now that I think about it, though, I think we did get an elephant uh, when I did when we did multiplayer. Well, we obviously did. I just forgot. Keep moving. Next Keep. steps marked on your map. Okay. Let's do this. So let's see. We got to go way, way up there. I mean, you guys have already seen kind of how much I've traveled around just here. Uh, that gives you an idea of how large this place is. So. Let's put the marker and get going. We got a long run ahead of us. Here we are. Next place. Okay. Okay, let's see what's coming Station after us now. Activated. We've already done elephants, so we don't have to worry about them. Probably either going to be cougars or hyenas, most likely. Or warthogs, maybe? Looks like the party started. Stay sharp. That sounds maybe like cougars. Where are they? Are they above us? Here comes something happened. You're gonna need to reactivate that thing. Good. It's reactivated. We're reading the station. It's active. Keep it up. There's another marker on your map. All right, now we run all the way up here. Let's go get our arrow off this dude. Oh, there is the other one. Okay, give me my arrow back. They must have spawned like up above me and got stuck or something, or maybe they can't jump down hills. I don't know, that arrow must have broken. All right, let's do this.
and here we are for the this last scan. It's around here somewhere. Good. We're reading the station. It's active. Now, last time we did this, the animals spawned down here and couldn't get to us. We'll see what happens this time. It didn't give me the warning like here there they come. Okay. Huh, weird. Station activated. Yeah, he didn't say the party's starting or something like that. Or that there we go. That looks like some angry Stay wildlife. <laughs> Data is up. Okay. Let's grab the station and head on back to the pod. Except for I gotta run 10,000 miles back to get back to the pod. Um, alright, so. Ooh, it's a bit of a drop. Let's go! No, that's. Thank God I got that backpack on. Jumped a little too far. <laughs> alright, you guys, I will see you back at the pod. For you, it'll be in one second. For me, it'll be in 10,000 years. So I came to this uh, covered area, and it looks like it leads down to a cave or something, but you, apparently you would need climbing gear to get down there, I'm assuming. Um, I don't even didn't even know they had climbing gear in the game, or maybe it's going to be implemented later. I uh, definitely don't want to fall down there right now, though, unless there's another way out. Pretty cool, though. Oh, by the way, this is where I'm at on the map, for those of you who are interested. So basically an N4 here. Alright, we are back at the pod. And let's get out of here. Turn to station. Okay. Not too hard of a mission, just lots of running around, man. Okay, you guys, excuse me. Uh, we should be able to hopefully research the next thingamadoodle in the workshop. Getting closer to our bow. Uh, so, let's see. We just researched that last, so now... Oh, man, we... Oh, crap, we only have 200. We need 250 to get this one. Okay, well, it is what it is. All right, you guys, I'm going to let you go here, and we will start the next episode and figure out what our next mission's going to be. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.